Alright, I'm shutting this thing down because the, the stupid camera stopped recording when I was doing my little trick I was doing. But that was a long video anyway, so you're lucky, kind of, I guess. And you're lucky I'm doing this for you, G. I don't have to be doing this for you. I'm doing it right now because I was going through the same thing. I know how you feel. So we're going to figure this out together. I already figured it out, but I'm going to show you the deal, and you're going to thank me. That's how it's going to be. And if you skip this thinking I'm just an idiot, well, when you come back, ha, who's an idiot now, fool? Straight up. Because there ain't no videos like this on the mizzle, fizzle, and ternizzle. You feel me? How much you got right here? 8%. I'm going to take this out. 8%. Bye-bye. How's -bye. this? Took the power button out. All right. Turn this around. I don't know how many screws have been here. So, where's my little scraper thing? All right. You know, just go like this real quick. I had a plastic one. I can't find it though, so. This will do it right now. For right now. This ain't no person open your computer thing video, so if I'm doing it right, like, you ain't came here for that, alright? You came here to fix your power button. Alright. Take this thing out. Okay. So, to do this, you need, like, a power button ribbon from another computer. I had an old Dell Experion. Old, 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 old. Things don't match up, different size ribbons, all that stuff, right? This is the Dallas Spring. You know, this looks nothing like the one for the Lenovo we got. Okay, I took that Lenovo one out. The Lenovo one was right down here. I don't know if you can see it. It was like right down here. Had a little strip going to right here. I took it all out, all right? Okay. So now, I get this Dell Experion ribbon. I'm pretty sure you can use like any ribbon. And then, um, all you gotta do is Put the, the shiny side down. All right, go over to that right here. Make it go like this. Boom, it's on. Just turn it on right now. Okay, I'm log in real quick, so I'll turn it back off. Let's see. Um, log in. Saying let it just do a thing real quick. It's like loading up, I guess, whatever. Okay. Boom. 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 Alright. So mine, mine don't shut down when I close this up. So. Close this up. Then you just put this thing back on. I might have to get like one of those air sprayers because I, I noticed that it's getting a lot of dust dirty because I have to always open it every time I want to turn it on. But if you're going what I was going through, you know, you don't care right now. You just want that thing to turn on. It's like it's bugging your whole life away and you're just trying to, you're just trying to use your computer. I seriously, so I'll do this for music, right? So I seriously like will start thinking about like, analog stuff that could just happen because I couldn't do nothing. I couldn't do my 3D modeling, couldn't do my music stuff, make beats, none of that stuff. So I, was, I, I actually invested in one, like a 8-track thing, a little cheap one, see how I, how I like it. Yeah. I like it because I don't like clicking away at stuff anyway, G. You know what I'm saying? I heard that for this thing died because it was only at 8%. There you go right there, G. Thank me later. Yeah, sir. Holla.